right, Phoebe, we're going to get you in the back of the ambulance. Why are we seeing these paradoxical rises in these profoundly worrying problems affecting children and young people? So it's not just diet, television or computer games. Bite on the left, please. It's a combination of many of these factors. 25% of five-year-olds now being classified as overweight and obese. This is an issue that's comparable to climate change. It's a major change in the human environment. The rate of type 2 diabetes rocketing up in children, and it never was a children's disease. In Australia, one in four five-year-olds are not ready for school. The parent has 79% impact on their child's attainment level. The school, 7%. We need to teach these parents how to sit on the floor and play with their kids. Wow. We feed up to 150 50 children in a week. Many of our parents are challenged by factors that do impinge on their ability to parent their children. The most common disease we now see in teenagers is depression and the tip of that horrible iceberg is suicide and for adolescents that's been getting more and more common. The economists promised us, let us create wealth and everyone will benefit. And of course, many have been left stranded. We're talking about making you healthy. If we don't respond to these challenges, then we will be looking at my generation as being the last generation that lives longer than its parents.